Okay, so here we go. It's Christmas Day at our house in July, of course, Christmas in July. Our next shipment of Melaleuca came in, and Stan is so excited because usually I open the packages before he gets home. <laughs> All right. So this one came a little later today. So, okay. So first off, I got the Kelsmicide AC. I'm not even sure how to pronounce it. I apologize. I have GERD. We're going to give this a try. All right. And then Stan, being an older man, does have uh, challenges with his prostate. And so we're going to give this a shot. The doctor liked what, what the ingredients were in it and said, let's try it, Stan, uh, to get his numbers back up. So Proavan is um, next on Stan's list. All right. And yes, I ordered all of my... Uh, bottles so Stan's taking all the pumps out of there okay so Stan is excited sorry guys he's just pulling everything out of there we're trying the lemon scented lemon bright because I absolutely love the apple okay now he's slowed down on me so these are all my empty bottles you guys don't need to see those but these are you know what yeah I'm going to show you these because these are awesome in my first order I had forgotten to slow down Stan they want to see everything I had forgotten my uh to put the bottles in there and I had some empty bottles but I'm gonna tell you right now that um, do this for yourself order the empty bottles or order the kits that already have the bottles with them that way they're already labeled and they're already pre-measured look and it tells you you know how much to fill each one and how much water how much solution all that so do yourself this favor and order your bottles okay because I didn't and I had to do some guesswork and it was fine it's okay but you want to do this to yourself all right now Stan spell your guard almost every order especially lately go ahead <laughs> no, they know the sell your guard because I order sell your guard in every order this is our disinfectant and uh, we spray Stan down with this every day when he comes home from work, especially if he like goes out to the grocery store or anything like that or is dealing with a lot of public. We spray him down, you know, disinfect him. We do not have Lysol in our home. I have not had Lysol in our home for years. Uh, but unfortunately, I learned later on that one of the products that I was using had chemicals in it almost as bad as Lysol. So a little upsetting, but here we go. We found our, our true love here. All right. Yep. And this is great. It has no chlorine bleach, ammonia, all those bad chemicals, formaldehyde, all those. So it's no chemical. Tough and tender. Um, I've gone a little blank here, but tough and tender I use in just about everything. All the, you know what I do like about a lot of these cleaners is you can use them in, you know, just about everything your bathrooms you know if you wanted to use say okay I ran out of tub and tender or I, I ran out of tub and tile or whatever that is you can use your solar guard and you can also disinfect you know like when you get vegetables or fruits uh, berries and stuff like that that tend to hold chemicals in them you can use a little bit of this with some water I don't know the exact solution but I will find out for you and post that but you can uh, soak your vegetables and fruits in solar guard Okay, we got this last month, and I am absolutely in love with the shampoo. I have not had my hair cut in quite a while, and then with COVID going on, it's been even more of quite a while, and so it's gotten really long and fuzzy and uh, hard to manage, but um, this shampoo has been awesome. It does not weigh my hair down, does not make it heavy, and we got the conditioner to go with it. It takes very little bit for my hair is probably to the middle of my back right now, it takes very little bit so these last um with both of us using it it, it lasts a true month even uh i think even longer i think we're up to six weeks now and it smells wonderful wonderful okay <laughs> you're you're pulling it out of the frame okay you guys know almost every order i have my liquid soap in there fun thing is is this month we only ordered one because we are still on the first one of the three pack that we ordered in our last order. 
And I think we've got probably another week and a half left of that, and that is without adding water to it. I don't add water to these because we want to know the true length of how we use it, and we constantly wash our hands. So I would say if you have kids in your home, um, a bottle of this will last you at least a week and a half to two weeks, and that's with washing constantly. There's two of us in our home, and in our bathroom alone, one of these has lasted uh, three weeks or longer. Come on, Stan. My GI control. Yes, I add the chocolate one to my hot chocolate. It was so good. Uh, I, I'm weird. I let my hot chocolate get cold, but it was good. So we got the chocolate, the vanilla, and I was told to try caramel praline and have Stan add it to his coffee instead of creamer. Yeah. So he's going to try that out this week for you. Caramel cream brulee. Caramel creme brulee. It's yeah. fancy yeah. stuff. <laughs> And if, for those that can't have gluten, like Carrie, it's gluten-free. It's, it's, it tastes really good. <laughs> Diamond Bright Dish Pods. Love these. Okay, what else you got yep. in here? Okay, so I'm, this is the first time I'm trying this. I am really excited. The Revive. Um, people that know me, that kind of know, I do not like stinky stuff. I have a nose that can smell stinky stuff a mile away. And so I'm constantly spraying. And I will admit, I am one that was addicted to Febreze. I could go through a bottle of Febreze in a day. Um, so we are going to try this. It is for um, linens and clothing. Okay. And I did, I did oh. get the bottle. Stan is mm -hmm. showing me. I did get the empty bottle and the measuring. That and all that, so those help a lot. And then, oh, whoops. Sorry. <laughs> my mints. Well, I, I will share them with Stan, but um, I love these mints because I there's certain ingredients that I cannot have, and I have to have sugar-free, gluten-free. These do, I believe, have guar gum in them, but um, it's not enough to, to bother my stomach. So if you are guar gum sensitive, um, go ahead and try. Um, let's see here. Okay, this does not have guar gum in it, but it has exotoil or whatever that is. Sometimes people have sensitivities to that. So, you know, just uh, here's the ingredients in this one. But they taste great, and, you know, if you're not a chewer, they last a while. Um, if you're a chewer, get the gum. The gum is excellent. Here's the ingredients on the cinnamon. And then there's one more, but Stan dropped it. I got the wintergreen. Let's see here. There. Nope. Nope, we got peppermint. Wintergreen, here it is. Sorry. Okay. So we got the wintergreen, and here are... Sorry, I'm right underneath the light there, so it's not helping you any. Hopefully you can see that. There we go. There. Okay. The ingredients in that for you so um try them out i cannot do a whole lot of over-the-counter mints because something in them tears my stomach up so um that these are what i've gone to um let's see what do we have here yeah we're so excited about this <laughs> i'm this, just gonna go ahead and show you like, inside Anna, this the tastes box. like kool-aid <laughs> okay so <laughs> Last month we only ordered two and we ran out within a week. So <laughs> here you go. We got one of each flavor. Some of these are my mom's, but let me be honest, not many of them are hers. We got lemon. We're going to try the uh, tangerine. Hold still, Stan. Oh. Tangerine peach. That is my mom's. Um, raspberry. This one is my favorite. It is, uh, yes, I can go through the whole thing, the whole picture of it and then another picture all by myself yep. so and fruit, fruit punch, punch the fruit just punch. like kool-aid stan thinks it tastes like kool-aid oh, i really good i just love it i just think it tastes good i don't There's think it no has that sugar no calories no gluten they're awesome to me it doesn't taste like that sweet sweet kool-aid but stan thinks it does so we're gonna let him have that but kids let me tell you right now if you have kids 
they're gonna like this better than Kool-Aid, I think. Yeah. I I was I was a Kool-Aid kid. I was raised on Kool-Aid, and I can tell you this to me tasted better. And of course, I'm an adult now, but not. Yeah, my taste buds haven't changed that much. Peach iced tea. This one's my mom's. My mom is a peach iced tea girl. She likes the peach, and um, she has a tendency to do the crystal lights. And crystal light. Probably shouldn't be saying this on camera, but you know, not the best thing in the world for you. Let's just put it that way. I think it has aspartame. Yes, it does. So there you go. There's no aspartame, no sugars. That you was know. it. And it's always fun to pop these things. You know, after. Except for you're not going to because right. your brother and sister are moving and want those yeah. to wrap things. 